Good morning from Weddington. Weddington is just waking up and so am I. I've come to the market here. It's the first day of the new independent market which is going to be a new quarterly independent market for Weddington. So I thought I'd come and have a look around and show you in case you can't get here or you want to know what it's like before you come. So let's have a look around. I'm going to go grab a coffee wake myself up. So local people may remember that there's been a market in the town before. Quite recently actually there was one which started in February 2022. It was called the Wellington Produce Market and eventually it became known as the Wellington Market, I think. And that ran until Easter this year. I think it was the Easter Saturday. And unfortunately, the people who ran that moved over to Australia, so they couldn't continue to run it, obviously. But local people wanted it to continue. So people who run the Nook and Cranny shop in town, a lovely independent shop, they decided to take it on and they've gathered together over 30 local traders for this market today and I think it promises to be a really really lovely event. Oh, it's so lovely to see so many local traders here, I mean really local, like just down the road. So much variety as well, it's a really really good mix of traders. I'm going to give you just a quick look around while I head for a coffee. I'm heading to Neil's coffee stop we we'll usually find him at the Basins, the Wellington Basins, but today he's here in the High Street. Oh, that coffee is seriously hitting the spot this morning. That was really, really nice and really a very good strength to it. Lovely to chat to Neil as well. I had a lovely chat about videos I might do in the future with him. So that was lovely. He made some good suggestions. Oh, it's really lovely to see local talent singing as well. Some singers have been organised by the people from the art centre, the Wellington Art Centre. This is really lovely. I saw one earlier as well up at a cliff ball. It's beautiful. Just finishing off my coffee here and I'm going to go find something to eat, I think. There's lots of choice here. Do you know what? I'm tempted by a donut from the Doe Brothers. <laughs> but I might get one of those and save it for later. I've got a big day of, um, a big day of editing today, so I <laughs> might save the donut for later. Go and have a look for something a bit more healthy for breakfast. It's really good. There's first aid training going on as well. St John's Ambulance are providing first aid training. I just got myself this lovely big bacon roll from P Daddy's. P Daddy's do event catering. They're also a community-led food redistribution business. They do lots of good work in the community. And they've used bacon from the local butcher, Tim Potter's, to make this roll today. And there's masses of bacon in it. This is gonna be my brunch, I think. And I bought a donut, I'll show you that as well bought a donut from Doe and that's going to keep me going when I'm doing my editing of this video and also the video this afternoon I'm going to make for town in Wiltshire. Just noticed there's an indoor market as well, I hadn't realised that. I'll have to go and have a look down there, it's, it's starting to rain so this might be a good opportunity to do that. Oh, I just got myself these beautiful shortbread cookies um, in the indoor market from the Two White Oaks store. Lovely range of things for sale there. Really friendly traders as well, so do go in and see them while you're having a look around the market. Oh, Olive and Rosie are doing pizza. I tell you what, that's got to be really good because I've had food from Olive and Rose before. I actually went to a party where he cooked. He's an Italian guy and he cooks amazing Italian food. They have a delicatessen here in Weddington. And upstairs they sell clothes as well. His wife upstairs runs a clothes business. Well, I need to go home now. I've been here ages, much longer than I intended to actually. There's loads going on here, lovely stalls, really friendly traders. It's been a lovely morning and I've eaten a lot of nice food as well and I've got lots more to eat later. 
So yeah, do pop along if you're able to. It's open until two today, and then it's going to be a quarterly market here in Wellington. Um, I'll put the dates in the description underneath this video for which months that's going to be. So thanks so much for watching. Do pop along if you can and support these lovely traders from the local Wellington area and support the local businesses as well in all the shops. Thanks so much for watching. I shall see you very soon in another video. Actually, tomorrow I'm going to be doing a video from Wiltshire. So I'm going to edit that one this afternoon as well. So look out for that. It's going to be from Calm in Wiltshire. Bye for now.